for money. I, in other words, I got to be at work on Sunday. I can't come. My boss man got a yacht, and he's working me. And he's throwing some crawls my way. And he has that yacht. Now, he ain't going to be on the place where I got to be Sunday. But I got to report. If anything go wrong, somebody going to find me before he must get to work. So I got to be there. Hey, Amen. Huh? Now, 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 the rich man weapon is a strong city. And I'm the, I'm, I'm the foundation of that strong city. I got to keep it. I got to keep things turning. Hey, Amen. God forbid that I take time out for myself. God forbid that I should take off a day and go in God's house and worship the Lord. Amen. I've I, I got to see, see, see the Bible said you can uh, bring it down every stronghold. Amen. See, there are strongholds that we have in our lives that we don't even realize there are strongholds working in our lives. Amen. Uh, hello, somebody. And that stronghold, amen, we, we, we give them just enough to keep a roof over our head. Y'all don't want to talk to me. Hello, somebody, amen. Because to whom you serve, that's who servant you are, amen. And if your master just happened to be feeding you crumbs, that blessing of the Lord make it rich so they ain't beat over. If you get some crumbs from God's table, see the woman, the, the, the Grecian woman said, Lord, even the, the dogs eat the crumbs that fall from their master's table. Y'all don't want to talk to me. In other words, see, my dog is my friend, my best friend. She could have said even the cats, but, but she was trying to get over a point. And then later on, the young people would try to explain it to you, and they would say, that's my dog. But some of them still don't catch on to what the scripture is talking about. Amen. So, so, so they're saying that, hello, somebody, amen. Even the dog seek the bread to fall from his master's table. Now, I, 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 I don't know how big your, your false man yacht is, but my God, the earth is a footstool. I'm just saying, amen. So, so a crumb falling from his table might be a couple billion in my pocket. I might end up being your dog, but I'd have to be your big dog. Uh, 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 I'm just saying, amen. Uh, uh, I'm just saying, amen. See, we got to get rid of, we got to get past these barriers, uh, uh, these strongholds, amen. Uh, Y'all don't want to talk to me. See, I, I, I like I like the scripture. I, I like going to the scripture. I like the scripture said in, 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 in Second uh, Corinthians uh, chapter ten and four. It said, "For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through the pulling down, but mighty through God, or mighty through the Word, or mighty through the Spirit." Amen. You got to get in another mindset. You got to have a transformed mind. You got to have a different spirit. You got to have a different mindset if you want to take down them strongholds. Amen. See, a poor man has one mind and a rich man has another mind. Hello, somebody. A rich man, boy, must know you hungry. Hello, somebody. And if a rich man, if he got rich for being hungry, he don't never want to be hungry again. And that's what drives him. But with the Lord, you can learn to be content in whatever stage you're in. Amen. When you get the riches, the true riches. Now, I'm not talking about earthly riches. I'm talking about true riches. I'm talking about the word of God. He said, mighty through God. A mighty through the riches of God. Yes. Huh? To the pulling down of strongholds. Amen? See, there's a stronghold that's established. See, see, and, 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 and whoever controls the mind or whoever control the head controls the whole body. Amen. So if I got your mind captivated, if I got your hello somebody, I pretty much got you handcuffed. I pretty much got your legs shackled down. I pretty much hello somebody. Now I can take the shackle off your legs and I can take them off your hands, but if I keep them on your mind, yeah. huh? If I keep them on your mind, see, see, that becomes a stronghold. See, if I establish fear, y'all don't want to talk to me. See, you don't wonder why your son hanging around the bad folks. But the bad folks got guns and they keep cocking them around. He know they're a bust of cat. Huh? Hello, somebody. And he know they ain't scared of what the man going to do. 
So he gonna hump it down and do what they said. If they pay at the joint, he gonna huh, hello somebody and try to keep them laughing and grinning. He don't want to upset them. And that's why they said sometimes you can get in too deep. Hello, somebody. I'm just saying, amen. Uh, I thank the Lord, amen. Uh, uh, see, see it's, a, it's a pulling down of strongholds. See, they, they're not doing it like they used to do it, amen. They used to would beat you up. Now they just uh, pop a cap and throw you in a bag. Hello, somebody, amen. So you got to be aware of all these things. See, I, I want my child to have to, to go to college, but I, I got to have him in a special place. I, I, I got to have them in a special school nowadays because some of them schools, they'll do, hello somebody, amen, the teachers teach them one thing, but the teacher actually is scared to teach. Yeah. Uh, hello somebody, amen. Huh? And now they got social media from Kim and Keith to pull off his belt. They don't put that on social media. We're going to get that teacher out of here because we need the bad children running this school. Oh. And guess what? When you pull, you don't have no choice but to send your child. Is, is, is anybody getting a breakthrough? Is, it, is anybody getting a reason why you need a different mindset? Is it, 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 beginning, it, it, it beginning to be clear to you why you ought to acknowledge the word of God? Why you ought to come to the teacher? Why you ought not to be late to class? Why you ought to be consistent? Why you ought to not be talking but be attentive? Because this is what I need. This is the avenue of my blessing. Hello, somebody. Hello, somebody. Amen. See, the Bible said God had a blessing and no sorrows. Amen. See, I want to be blessed, but I don't want them sorrows. In other words, I want, I want to be blessed, but I don't want the police lights behind me. I don't want them finding my stash. And if they find my stash, I want them to find the whole stash of the Bible and the power of God. Y'all don't want to talk to me. Uh, uh, hello, somebody. I, I want to do it in, a, in the right way. Hello, somebody. I'm just saying, hey, man. I thank the Lord. See, I, I got to get, I got to get these strongholds. I, I, hello, somebody. Hey, man. See, Jesus said it like this. He said, upon this rock. Uh, hello, somebody. He said, flesh and blood. He said, who do you say that I am? And, 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 and some of the disciples said, well, some said John, and some said. He lied, and some said Jeremiah. He said, but the who do you say that I am? He said, because I got to get your mind. Hello, somebody. Hello, somebody. And, and, and Peter said, thou art the Christ. Thou art the anointed. Thou art the one God put his spirit on. Hello, somebody. Amen. And, and Jesus said, flesh and blood has not revealed this to you, but my Father, which is in hell, somebody. Amen. In other words, God has given you a revelation. Hello, somebody. I'm just saying, amen. So God has allowed you to have to know this certain group of knowledge, amen. And Jesus turned around like this. Now you got to understand Jesus because he's deep. Hello, somebody. Somebody said deep. deep. Somebody said swim. You can't swim. Deep. Too much water and swim in. Learn how to flow. Learn how to flow. Hello, somebody. You got to flow with the flow. Yeah. Hello, somebody. I'm just saying, amen. You can't go out there in that deep water until you're going to swim to show now. Hello, somebody. You better learn how to float. Hello, somebody. You better become a boat yourself. I'm just saying. Huh? I'm, uh, I'm just saying. Amen. So so you got to understand what Jesus said. Jesus said, uh, pardon, he said, not a petrol, a stone. Amen. He said, Peter, you the stone. Amen. He said, hello, somebody. He said, and upon this rock, y'all don't want to talk to me. See, see, this is the temple of the living God. This is the church of the living God. Y'all don't want to talk to me. He said, upon this rock, shall I build my church? He talking about building this. I know somebody. How many of y'all know that this guy, how many of y'all know that Jesus, how many of y'all know that Jesus is the head of the church? Uh, 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 supposed to be the head of your body. Uh, uh, supposed to be your teacher, your guide, your master, your leader. Y'all don't want to talk to me. Uh, 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 I'm talking about flowing. I'm talking about just laying back. I'm talking about being still. See, you, you try to do like this here. You try to get there on your own, you ain't going to make it. Be still. God will fight the battle. Be still. God will fight the battle. Be still. 
little feet for me until we get over here. <laughs> God, if I, I held somebody, and I well, got the hell he to do up and stand up. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, hell somebody, I'm just, huh? Hell somebody, hey, amen? See, you got to go with the flow. Yeah, you got you to be still. You got to see God already got a flow going. See, there's a flow going down and there's a flow going up. You can keep on going down. See, that dial is this is gravitational and it's pulling you down. And poverty is pulling you down. It's the gravitation of this world pulling you down. But Jesus is from above and that stuff pulling you up. So if you flow it up, you flow it toward God. If you flow it down, I don't know. Yo, somebody, amen. I, I, I thank the Lord, amen. amen. I give God praise, glory, and honor, amen. See, God told me to swim upstream and not, not downstream because there's a net down at the bottom down there and they're catching all the fish, amen. Hello, somebody. They're catching them, cleaning them, gutting them, and y'all. Yes, sir. And I ain't none of this meal. Hello, somebody. But I'm on my way home to the promised land. And my home is up there and not down here. See, I come from up there. I'm going back, y'all. I'm just saying, hey, amen. Uh, so, so that, in other words, there's a strong hope. And our weapons, and you can't fight this thing with your pistol. You can't fight it. He didn't say don't have no pistol. He didn't say don't have no knife. He said you can't fight this. He said our weapon. He said you won't even need it. He said for 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 the weapons of our warfare are not fleshly, not sensual, not not worldly. Hello, somebody. Huh? But the weapon. See our warfare. The warfare in itself, cardinal weapons. Don't do any good in this warfare. See, if you crucify Jesus, you don't do that but straight strengthen him up. He said, My spirit was made perfect in weakness, so uh, I mean, you're caught in the weapon. That's all you can do. You can kill and never to the cross and all that. Hello, somebody. That, that, that's what, hello, somebody. But that only strength to be in the spirit realm. Amen. They can, hello, somebody. I'm just saying, amen. I thank the Lord. I give God praise, glory to God. But we have weapons, amen, that are not carnal, amen. That are, hello, somebody. I'm just saying, amen. We have weapons that are not abusive, amen. amen. We have weapons, weapons that are not hateful, amen. amen. Huh? He, we fought the warfare. How many of y'all? How many y'all know that a hater hating on you is a weapon that the, that the devil is using against you? Amen. What you say? See, his, his weapon is not caught. Now, now he ain't using a card in the weapon. Now he might lead that hater. To pick up a card in the weapon. But that hater is doing a lot with you just with that simple weapon. Y'all don't want to talk to me. Maybe we talk to these young people. If any of y'all young people in here know that the devil has a weapon called peer pressure, oh, yeah. it's not cardinal, and mama and them may understand it, that that peer pressure, y'all don't want to talk to me, has a certain range of power and it begins to overwhelm you. How many of y'all know when, when they talk about you and put you down on social media, they jumping off high beat. Y'all don't want to talk to me. See, that was a weapon used against it, amen. A lot of people are having them locked up because they see it as a weapon. You talk about, I don't see why they didn't make them do that. That devil is a lie. They possessed their mind. They took over their whole body. Whoever controlled the mind controlled the body. Y'all don't want to talk to me. I heard him say, Thou anointest my head with oil. Why do you think he's anointing my head with oil? 